Hey, what's up everyone? Johnny the Geek here and uh, today I'm going to be building a system in 15 minutes. Uh, I apologize for the audio. Uh, I don't have my lapel right now so hopefully um, you'll be able to hear me okay as I go through this. There's probably going to be some background music going on now anyways. Now I started recording, right? And uh, it's going on about, uh, I don't know, 30 seconds now. Uh, I'm going to try to do this with no edits straight through. Right, building this uh, cheap little system here, and at the same time that I'm building it, I'll talk a little bit about it. I'm going to be building an AMD system right now, and so oh, I need this. So I'm going to be uh, preparing the uh, motherboard first, and so this particular system, I accidentally bought uh, the wrong motherboard. Right, so I was supposed to buy a socket 939 motherboard because I had a uh, socket 939 CPU. And then I bought this motherboard and it turns out it's a socket 940 AM2 Plus uh, CPU. And uh, so I ended up having to buy a new CPU. I bought a quad core here for about uh, $84 off of Tiger Direct. It's a quad core X4-9750 by AMD and I need a knife so I'll be right back all right so I got a knife um, I've actually kind of cheated here this motherboard already had a ram in it so I'm gonna take it out Right, so here we go. Already spent about two minutes. I'm gonna open this thing. You always want to cut away from you. Ah, really, you should use a pair of scissors, but I don't have any. All I've got is this knife. And uh, I do apologize about the audio. I had a lapel, but the battery ran out. Right, so be very careful with taking this out. There's pins. You do not want to break the pins. I should have uh, taken a little bit more time to carefully open this package, but I'm kind of rushing it right now, and hopefully I don't F things up. Oh, okay. So, we've got the quad core CPU out. I'm going to drop the CPU in now. Going to line it up. There is a little arrow on the corner of the CPU and there is a little arrow on the corner of the socket. So I'm going to match those up. Drop that in. I need some thermal grease and I left that in another room. Alright, sorry, that took damn near a minute. Uh, I have some uh, Arctic Silver 5 here, some quality stuff. You don't have to use that quality stuff. Put on my put a little goop right there. Spread this around a little. I also had a Zaleman 
thermal grease that uh, it's got a little brush on it. Oh, it's all dried out. Never mind. All right, so now I'm gonna throw on my fan. This is a very cheap system that I'm building. So we'll put the fan on, clip it in. that you ground yourself right you want to use an anti-static wristband and uh, I don't have one always practice safety precautions do not be careless like I am Alright, so this case, I actually got that fries. This case with a power supply, 380 watt power supply, 20 bucks. Can you believe that? $20. Where's my screwdriver? minutes already? Dang. I only got 10 minutes left to build this thing. Now, you're probably thinking, well, it's already got a power supply. You're not spending any time building by putting in the power supply. I suppose so. Right? Oh, look at that. It already has the uh, standoffs in it. Hey man, if it's already got it in there, it's already got it in there. I'm not about to spend the time taking it out. Just to show you. Oh, the I.O. shield. I need the I.O. shield. Which this motherboard does not have. But uh, normally there'd be an I.O. shield. I apologize for not being very on the money. Uh oh. Ah. Dang it. I'm missing two of the standoffs. I need to get a tool. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay, so I don't have the proper tools to undo this standoff thing. So, what I'll need to do is just add my own standoffs. Oh, great. 
These aren't the right ones. Well, whatever. Moving on then. This is by far the worst build I've ever done in my life. Why did I have to choose this? <clears throat> As a challenge. Right? So, but uh, you want to make sure that you secure the motherboard using all of the proper standoffs. But it's coming down to let's see. It's been ten minutes. Ten minutes. I only got five minutes to build this thing. Good God. Audio check reset. Optical drive, SATA cable, slide that back in. I hit my 15 minute mark. Last thing. Video card. Plug that in. Uh, I think that's pretty much it. Oh, the hard drive. Hard drive. Set of cable. Plug 
that in. That's pretty much, we're done. Let me fire this baby up. Plug in a monitor. Aside from trying to find stupid tools and handoffs, I think I did a pretty decent job. Let's see. Monitor is not plugged in. Oh, no keyboard detected. Dang it. Button on this thing. Hey, look at that. We're posted. Booted. Huh? Not bad. Not bad. All right, hopefully that was 15 minutes. Actually, I'm looking at the counter now. It was 17 minutes. Dang it. But uh, close enough. Good enough, I guess. It was kind of half-assed. If I spent another 15 minutes, it would, uh, it would work out okay. All right. Uh, thanks for watching. Johnny the Geek, out. Peace.